All right, boys, this video is going to be a bit slower paced than usual. Um, I have the big C that's been going around. <laughs> I probably can't say it because I'm probably going to get demonetized, but there we go. If you like this style of video, please let me know in the comments and I'll do more of it. It's a little bit slower paced, a little bit more chill. Imagine if Brett and Wiljam had a collab. Yeah, yeah, let's go with that. <laughs> yeah, so I'm actually, I'm actually sick. I've actually got right now uh this video is probably gonna get demonetized because i said that <laughs> uh but i've just seen this play rust reddit post of the biggest hotel made in vanilla uh and i want to check it out this is a completely fresh i've literally only just discovered this so yeah let's 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 dig into it it's rustified eu long 2 we can try and get on there rustified.com eu long 2 there we go i found it i think i might die i am so ill <laughs> This is not good. <laughs> <laughs> of course I spawn at night time. We've got to get to V... V18. Where's... Where's that? Oh, there it is. Look. The best hotel. Uh, so a normal room is 4,500 stone. Damn. And then another room is 1,800 metal, which we can probably do. Let's, uh... Let's try and get there first. You know what? There's something quite peaceful about starting a rust wipe at night time i changed my mind uh maybe it's just the illness talking but this is kind of nice i feel like a bat wait wait yo i'm sorry boys this video isn't going to be high pitched or hyper or you know the, the usual uh i'm dying inside so while i get to the destination let me introduce you to a corporate brit who isn't sick uh and we'll talk about today's sponsor thank you wait what is that is he wearing Manscaped Boxers 2.0? Because if he is, he's a Chad. Oh, I think he wants to tell us something. Manscaped just released a new collection of anti-chafing high-performance boxer briefs with both function and fashion in mind. Why does he sound like that? My personal favorite style are the gold nugget ones. Oh, that's corporate Brit. I've seen him around. I actually just recently went on holiday and the holiday involved a lot of walking and these boxes are perfect because of the anti-chafing. As you can tell, I am a big fan. I love Manscaped.com. All right, all right. I'll go to the website down because they are genuinely the best. You can get 20% off plus free international shipping when you go to manscaped.com forward slash I am Brit. You won't regret it. They are amazing. Thank you, Manscaped. Bye. Oh, my days. Oh, my day. I think this is it. I think this is it. Wow. Is this like a Jordan Rant's alt account or something that he's just playing on? Dude, <laughs> this thing is insane. I've got my 1800 metal ore, which is what I needed. Uh, and I'm going to see, uh, see what the room's like. I think I get my own private room. This thing is ridiculous. Look at this, man. Whoa. No fighting, no griefing, no stealing. All rooms are equipped with a campfire, a furnace, and two large boxes. Dude, this is crazy. Hello, my fellow Cuban. <gasps> Hello. This is uh, pretty cool. Hi. I'm here this is for... pretty cool, ain't it? Yeah, is this yours? No. This is awesome. Saw off of Reddit. Yeah, me too, man. How'd you get a room here? You know? Cool. Um... A lot of oh here we go stone 150 VIP is like yeah VIP room is like ten I got a note uh, oh I just got a note orf. this guy's still nine, talking nine. <laughs> you just bought a room or well, make sure to follow the rules also make sure to never go on the roof why if you need any help he's got his own Discord your room is number nine and the code is zero zero two zero uh okay this this is my room zero zero two oh oh dude <laughs> oh, okay not even a workbench though i mean come on man but the vip oh, room. God, oh god hello how's it going friend yo we're neighbors dude Oh my god, this is wonderful! We're neighbors! I think it's what we should do yeah. is we should work towards getting a VIP room. That's 10,000 metal ore or 7,000 sulfur. Where are the VIP rooms? They're upstairs. I'm, I'm guessing that there's a lot of rooms in there, dude. Stop. It says don't go on the roof. Why? 
Why not? All the rooms are equipped with campfire, curtains, large. Ha! Huh. I suppose the weep one has a large curtain. Okay, yeah. that's why. That's why we don't go on the roof. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna work towards. Get get in a uh, Hello, VIP room. Uh, Wait, do you live in the VIP? Yo, have you got a VIP you room? So fucking rich. Yeah. Is it good? You got a VIP room. Sheesh. Is it is, good? Is it good? Guy looks loaded. I like the balcony. What uh, what kind of stuff it's do you get? Balcony. He's so rich. Hey, heck, you are so fucking rich. <laughs> Yo, do you want to come on a, a farming? Adventure to try and get more stuff to buy a VIP room each. Oh, we come in. Ooh. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Sheesh, this is wonderful, my brother. <laughs> this is wonderful. Let's go and uh, farm up uh, 10,000 metal ore. That's going to take some time. All right, we've got about half now. Got what? Well, almost half. I'm going to take a pit stop back at the hotel. And there is actually a shop next to it. Uh, and I want to go see what that sells. Just so we can plan our next move. Where, where are we? Where's, okay, it's down the road. All right, I feel safe when we're here because there's turrets. And those turrets are on safety mode. So basically it means if anyone fights you, uh, they're going to get shot. But as long as we stay peaceful, we won't get shot. Apart from the cactus trap base. Mimio, are you here? What? Hello, Rumi's. Okay, I can close. I need to get it. Is there a workbench here? Ooh. Dude, that's well good. We could buy one right now. Go for it. Any bullets? Oh, 30 bullets too. Bro, we could buy two. We could buy three. We don't need sulfur. Loaded. Where's my room? I mean, I'm kind of like taking loot from... I wonder if they have guest codes on there. <laughs> All right, we got MP5. Look at that, huge. Let me unload some ammo. Uh, we're working on the metal situation to a VIP room. We got one, two, three, three and a half K. We need 10 K, so that's not not great. Almost there. Uh, do I have any wood? I actually don't. I could go buy more MP5s. I might just do that while I can, because dude, that's cheap. That's cheap as heck. <coughs> Ooh, we get to use our campfire. Look at that. Using all the resources. We've got a lovely view. Look at... Oh. This is further than I get in the normal rust wipe. Look at this, dude. Very well. Make some pants. Some shoes. Gloves. With my newfound weapon that I've just got from my hotel, uh, I'm going to attempt to take the abandoned military base, which is a monument that has some scientists in there and stuff. Uh, I'm going to attempt to... Uh, to get their loot. I don't know if this is going to go well or not. Oh, there's a whole, another horse. This horse is everywhere. Ooh. Billy crate. Nice. If you could stop hiding around the corner, that'd be great. Uh. Oh, my MP5 broke. Uh oh. Oh no. Oh shoot. Good job, they're bad aim. Just like me. Well, I think we're, uh. I think we have to skedaddle. Uh, I think I'm out of here. Where's my horse? Ah! After this, I actually just passed out for the night. And when I woke up in the morning, uh, we got to work. And a lot happened. Alright, I'm back. Uh, the hotel... Uh, so I kind of went to sleep last night after I died. 
and I think a lot has happened here overnight. <coughs> um, because none of the turrets work. The turrets themselves have uh, stopped. Oh, is, there, is that an airdrop? Is that an airdrop over there? What? Oh, wow, it's actually here. No way. Sweet. Oh. Uh, let's get back to the hotel quick before we die. Damn, girl. That's got a good. Alright. Here we are. Turrets are still off. I'm not ah! I'm not sure. There's a train. I'm not sure what to do about that. Uh, do I take the opportunity and, like, get myself a free bolty? <laughs> this place is no longer safe. Hello? Hello, man. You, you good? Yeah, yeah, I'm good, man. Oh, can you put me a bag down here? Your staff? Oh, yeah, yeah, of course, man. Wait. Oh, I was going to try and kill him, but... That would be a terrible idea. He's owner of the of the hotel or one of the staff members. Ah, it's just crafting now. This hotel's cool, man. Is it yours? Yeah. Oh, dude, it's so good. Thank you, man. Are there any uh, VIP rooms left? Yeah, there is uh, multiple, but they're not on the sale right now. They're not finished. Oh, okay. Well, I'll be wait. I'll be waiting, ready for when they are. What's your room number? Uh, number nine. He can close and open the door. He can close and open the doors. That's so cheeky. Okay. Th you thank you. Have a what? Nice day. That means that all of this loot that everyone is getting is his. Like he could just access it. <laughs> what the hell? There's a lot of trust in that guy, dude. What the hell? I need to get 75 scrap. If I can research pistol ammo, that'd be quite useful. Why are all your turrets off? Don't feel safe. Uh, they're broken. I don't know. Our fucking uh, electric man is shit, man. Oh, okay. Alright, I'm gonna go farm 75 scrap to research pistol ammo. Uh, let's go to the supermarket. Massive compound over there as well. Ooh. All right, we're back. I have 155 scrap. Uh, I'm gonna go research a pistol bullet because in this hotel, I think the turrets are back on. Yeah, they are. Okay, I feel safe again. Uh, in the hotel, there is a, a whole section for you to research and craft stuff. Look at this, dude. We got a disco ball. We got a tier one, tier two, and tier three. Pretty cool. Uh, let's research. One of these bad boys. Very cool. Uh, so now I can craft it. I wonder if I could ask him to repair my MP5. That'd be kind of useful. Let me see if I can get some more ammo going. Hey, can you repair my MP5? Uh, I don't have the BP, but Sanch does. Oh, okay. Uh, I think he's AFK right now. Okay. All right, so we need to get, I think, it, is it still, I mean, there's not for sale at the moment, but he said he's working on it. Yeah, 10k metal ore. So if I, I'm thinking about doing the large, uh, the giant quarry, or the large, wow, I just can't think right now. <laughs> the giant excavator pit, but we need crude oil for that. Not crude oil. Oh my God. Uh, let's try that again. Yeah, okay, I'm thinking about doing the giant excavator pit uh, for the... 10,000 metal ore that we need but we need oil for that and the first only place we can get it is junkyard so I think I'm about to make a really long run all the way up to junkyard to grab some oil yo it's Ew. yo
All right, after a late night run, we are finally back at the hotel and we have three diesel fuel. So we can actually gear up now uh, and go and use the uh, giant excavator. As I found, let's go do it. I love the like community vibe that you get living in a hotel. It's pretty cool. You're just chilling. Hey, does anyone have uh, MP5 BP and can repair one of my MP5s? You? Yeah. I have. It's yeah. low HP. I need. Yeah, I need repair. Do, let's make a deal. Okay. Uh, uh, give me the MP5. Give me the MP5. We're gonna trust him. No, no, you give me three kisses and I give you a brand new one. Mwah. 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 That's a good deal, man. Hey, you hey, get four, so you get this back as well. Ah, oh, thank you. Okay. Okay. Let's, let's go. go. Let's That's so wait. kind I here. I got a brand new MP5, dude. Let's go. Now we just gotta wait for our sulfur to cook. Make some more ammo. And we... I, okay, I don't like that. <laughs> I don't like that. That's weird. Uh, he just let himself... Okay, that's... Whatever. That is a lost sight. Woo. Have I got enough ammo for this? I don't think I do. Wait, is that an airdrop? Is that... Is that an airdrop? That's straight up an airdrop. How do I get that? There's so many scientists on there. Oh. They're like stormtroopers. They miss a lot. Did they get nerfed? That's a terrible airdrop. Oh. Another one somewhere. Oh, there he is. Oh my days. Is that a player? Better not come here, boy. Uh oh. Is he dead? I think he might be dead. Uh, I suppose we should probably go look. Oh, we had grenades. And a python? He was planning something mean, dude. Alright, it's doing it. It's doing it. I don't know how much three uh, crude oil is going to get us, but we are here. It's working. <laughs> Wait, the airdrop's ready too. What? Hell yeah! So when you uh, when you're in the excavator for a bit, you uh, you get a free airdrop every time you use it. But obviously, the person before me didn't actually call the airdrop in because it's ready to go. Very very cool. Let's see how much we've got already. Uh, how do I get down safely? And it all compiles and all gets collected in the two piles at the end. Uh, one in a truck and one in a pile. And then see what we got already. Wow. Wow, that's a lot. Dude, that's crazy. And that's just from one pile. We might have to head home and come back. 
I don't think... I, I might do that, actually, because I'm risking way too much on me right now. I have so much loot. Uh, I'm going to loot this pile, then head home and then come back. And hopefully, the airdrop has come and the scientists haven't respawned. I think we've already got enough metal frags to buy the VIP room. Dude, that's mental. Get so much. All right, I'm going home. I'm going home and come back. That was a successful trip. We have just a absolutely ridiculous amount of metal. I didn't think you get that much, but that's me that is insane. That I didn't think it was that good. That's crazy. Oh, the airdrop. Oh, I forgot about the airdrop. Ooh, baby. All right, let's go. All right, we made it back to the hotel. Look at that, dude. Any VIP rooms for sale yet? Uh, yeah, they are. They're not they're in stock. I need to negotiate. All right, let's see if we can get ourselves... Hello, can I uh, talk to the managers? Or the staff? Are they in? This hotel's sick, man. It's amazing, isn't it? I wish the turrets were on now. Yeah, that would be nice. Hey, are you a staff? Привет, мой, привет, мой друг. No, no, I am uh, VIP. Oh, I'm looking to buy VIP. Yes, yes, you want, hey. you want room review? Uh, yeah, please. Hey, big, big man, big, big man, Frank, are you a Brit? I think you've been constantly trying to play with Jordan Rands. I think. I can give room review. Come, come. So Ooh. this is, uh, there's two furnaces there, there's windows and there's boxes there. And then this is the cool part, this is balcony. And then, yeah, this is ah! balcony, man. Very nice. What the heck? I need to speak to a staff member. Hello, where are you? I'm here, what do you need? I need to trade for a VIP room. Where are you? Where are you? Where are uh, you? Uh, that's not possible. Why not? I'm in my room right now. W which one's that? Uh, 212. What the? How many rooms are in this place? Jordan, is that you? Uh, Jordan, you need a goose. Yeah, hey, must be. But... Oh, 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 oh! What's happening? Ah! I don't know what's going on. Okay, yes. I have, uh, I have 8,000 metal fragments cooked. If I could get a VIP room, I'll give them to you. Uh, yeah, it's a deal. Okay, come in, give me a second. Oh. Where's he going? I want to know where their main base is. What the f Dude. Okay, man, come. Come, come okay. with me, man. Be Frank. Oh, we get the upgrade. Yes. Which one's mine? Is this mine? <gasps> yes! VIP4. What's the code? Uh. Oh, the yeah, there's no code on this. Hotel, this is a trap place. And uh, now you have to, like, scroll down with the arrows. Oh, it's Your a code. Trap. It says. It's. It's empty. Oh, what the fuck? I already know John Rantz is living here. Yeah. He doesn't have a VIP room. That, that's what I heard. So you're cooler. That means I'm better, right? Yeah, yeah, I guess so. Okay, man, I'm so sorry for that. Seven, eight, nine. Sick, really? <laughs> really? Really? That's the code. Thanks, man. That's the worst code I've ever seen in my life. Alright, little mixing table. Looking good. And got our own balcony. Oh, nice, dude. So I'm gonna vacate out of room number nine and bring all my stuff here. If you wanna put that up for sale again. Oh. Okay. No, I get trapped. <laughs> okay, let's move all our stuff. Uh, the metal is in the box at the bottom. You wanna take as much as you need for a VIP. Okay, guys, just take nine k. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> They're all just pointing at me now. <laughs> okay, let's go. We, we live at the top deck now. We're we're. We're uh, the poor people now. We live in the VIP suite. Which one was mine? <laughs> I think it's number four. 
Yeah. And we got an airlock now. Yo, Brit, um, not, I mean, big man Frank, I'd like to ask you something about um, YouTube and stuff. Yeah, so I got a small ass channel. I just made a Rust movie. Do you think, I got like 80 subs right now. Do you think instead of making a movie, I should do like 25 minute or like 40 minute videos? Like, what would you, um, what's it called? Rust um, movies like are really, really uh, saturated. So try and do something unique. All right. This is when the owners came on and invited me to their team. And he told me the how, story what, about this hotel. How, how long have you been playing this wipe? From the start, actually one day, I joined one day later because my initial goal was uh, to get a real, I mean, to make a really nice uh, cave base. That was my like main goal. So I like, I missed the wipe day, so I had to, I had to uh, go through all the monthly servers to find oh, the empty cave because every cave was taken. Yeah. It was yeah. really like... Wait, you have a cave base? Yeah, I have a oh, sick cave dude. base. Yeah, I I mean cave bases are so OP if you think. No, like you can't M L R S it. I don't know how, how to pronounce that. Yeah, 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 no, yeah. And uh, it's overall very like strong. Yeah. Oh, I didn't even realize you've walled off the entire. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Most of the time I played completely solo. No. Because way. Uh, one week after the wipe. All my friends left because we were throwing out uh, guns since we didn't have uh, anywhere to store them <laughs> and then it got really boring so they left wow they, like they didn't they have still not joined so i invited new friends but that was just a week ago That's so crazy. from here we can enter the base Do you have any turrets i need to worry about uh, not yet okay uh, this is just a simple uh, concept uh, concept yeah oh cactus and when you come in um you can see there's towers in every tower i have a bolt rifle with like ammo and uh, <laughs> bags for everyone so wow. if anybody uh, lands in here they cannot wall inside this in this area you can't build anything it's like yeah yeah, yeah. you can't place a thing so if they like come in i can just snipe them and they can't do anything against this they uh -huh. can't wall they can't run they're just stuck here That's people have crazy. tried and i like killed six <laughs> people with the scrap pelly myself wait i'll turn the turrets off now wait After, do you have a lot of it connected to your phone yeah most of them are connected <laughs> to my phone you know the rust plus app yeah yeah, yeah. On, you know. now I, the one problem i have is that some russian kid keeps looting my furnaces <laughs> That's, it uh, annoys me very much it's so annoying <laughs> Like, come on, it's a monthly server. Why, why do you do this shit? Um, Inside, okay, I'll turn the heli tower on now. Who's that? No, you see, that's the Russian kid that I just <laughs> talked about. This is him. <laughs> you see, <laughs> caught in 4K, man. Literally caught in 4K. <laughs> just sneaking around. Oh, no. Hello. Hey, wait in the. Wait in the okay. There, look, yeah. Yeah, I, when I pull the trigger, uh, the whole cave gets electrocuted. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I I was so paranoid that I get raided that I did everything in my like That's knowledge so good. <laughs> to try and uh, make something. Uh, Who's gonna safe. raid this though, man? This is crazy. This one. Okay, come here. Oh. Okay. Uh, stay here. Wait. Uh, I'll close the doors behind because this Russian kid Whoa. might try something. Okay, so basically in the first room there is uh, our airlock, we have bags in the airlock. Now if you come here, uh, it's quite empty at the moment because we, I used everything I had to build that hotel. But yeah, this is the depot room with the body here. Uh, and uh, let's let 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 I let you take the TC then. Uh, uh, you can, uh, I can turn the electricity on. Wow. I'll open it up for you. Yeah, I've got it. And if you pull this, <laughs> you see everything gets electrocuted. So That's yeah, when mad. you come in, this is where I spend my time. Uh, yeah. I had a picture here, but <laughs> oh shit, I forgot my bad. <laughs> Organized it. Okay, this is basically the main core. It's like, uh, you really have to use like at least 100 rockets to get back there. Right? <laughs> that way it's fully sealed. 
Then if you come up here, we also have a loot room on the very top. Yeah, we used to have uh, cameras on the compound, so when we came to the uh, computer station, up this ladder edge, the other one, then we could also see people or whatever was like going on on the ground, so it was like really like uh, secure. So, how did this all happen or come to life, you may ask? Well, uh, the story goes like this. Uh, once upon a time, uh, I uh, came to a, a, a plan that I should make something cool. And I've made hotels in the past. But uh, now that there are, have been many new updates and uh, Rust has changed uh, quite a bit, uh, hotels have quite uh, managed in my opinion. He then went on to explain that he had to actually defend his hotel. There were multiple clans in the area and he had to solo raid them to get rid of them. If this doesn't scream absolute Chad, then I don't know what does. And on our way back to the hotel, he said something that I thought was really, really wholesome. Appreciate it. Yeah, man, I, uh, I, 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 I appreciate you as well. You get me hyped and excited. <laughs> Thanks, dude. So yeah, have a, have a, I mean, have a good stay. And uh, it's nice that uh, someone makes content of my hotel. <laughs> now I can like really memorize it. As, like, yeah, uh, dude, that's I awesome. I can always check the video. I can even show it to my girlfriend, you know. Yeah, that's cool. Looking forward to that. Awesome, man. Right, I'll uh, I'll see you later on. Thank you very much. Yeah. yeah. Bye. Bye. What a nice guy. What an absolute lovely guy. <laughs> that's really cool. Overall, staying at this hotel was awesome. The community vibe that you get with a place that has a hundred different rooms is really cool. And the fact that the guy that built it was absolutely a legend as well, that also helps. Thank you very much for watching today's video. I know it's a bit different from my usual stuff. Make sure you leave a like, subscribe if you're new, and I'll, uh, I'll see you in the next one. Peace out, boys. Goodbye.